Hi, guys, welcome back to my channel. Please share and subscribe my channel to get more interesting topic. Hi guys, uh, welcome to my channel. So hope all are doing fine. So one thing I am telling this uh, uh, this is today's topic is the practical pipe inspection. This is for as uh, per CC 3.1. How we have to inspect the practical pipe? Practical pipe. Those are given by in TWI or CCB exam. You can see here the channel link. So those are not subscribe yet my channel. Please subscribe it like and share it and if you have any comment if you need any other things to share with you so please tell us so i can uh, upload the more videos on that and this channel i am telling to you this channel includes not only this c 3.1 or big gas. you can see here lots of topics are there for welding and entity and also the biggest venting inspector on all and another most thing is that CC 3.1 and the big as if a 510 you can see lots of questions are there in this channel so definitely please don't forget to share this uh, uh, channel and subscribe it so please uh, start my uh, now you can see here the practical pipe inspection so uh, I will check now the practical pipe how we have to inspect and uh, what type of uh, pipe will be there to check and inspect it how to do so let's see you can see here the pipe the pipe it's how it looks like it's a pipe that's what api 1104 you have to inspect the pipe as per api 1104 this is the pipe inspection and you can see here that's how to find out that uh, weld uh, reinforcement height he is checking here so this is one of the uh, just uh, picture now we can see here from the beginning of the page so uh, you can see here high low and root gap measurement how we have to check this high low and root gap there is a acceptance criteria so we need to check this measurement also in you can see here this is our instrument gauge the high low and you can see here internal alignment and this is you can see here this is the root and this is the root this this is not in one line condition one in one line so you can see here so how much the miss alignment internal alignment how much so this is you can see here and it is here the root gap dimension you can see here from here what is the root gap is required you can see here in the WPS is mentioned the root gap so this is also need the acceptance criteria as per the api 1104 or any of the condition so for particular thesis 3.1 you have to go as per api 1104 acceptance criteria so this is high low and root gap measurement how we have to check you can see here now this is very important you need to know pipe inspection examination Remember in the CC 3.1 welding inspector examination, you are required to conduct a practical examination of a pipe test well. So they will give one pipe to you with welding. That is the V groove is there and it is welded, fully welded. And in this welding, there is so many defects will there. And that time you have to choose the defect and you have to check this is you have to check this is in uh, uh, acceptance criteria beyond the acceptance criteria or inside the acceptance criteria if it is beyond the acceptance criteria then it is a defect so just we will discuss later now you have to see the practical examination of the pipe test oil is complete thumb print sketch and a final report on your findings so they will give one pipe with welding and a complete thumb print sketch and a final report so final report they will give to you one report in that in that basis you have to find that uh, defect and you have to find the acceptance criteria what will be the time time allowed one hour and 45 minutes use your own code if that is api 1104 so you have to use the code api 1104 and the time is allowed is one hour 45 minutes What will be the inspection point? See carefully, very carefully this one. Pipe inspection point. Use a pencil. First, you have to use a pencil for a arrow lines, for the arrow lines. 
but make all written comments and measurement in link ink only so all written comments and measurement you have to use the ink only use pencil only for arrow lines so you can check here just i am giving to you example here just go and uh, this is this arrow line this arrow line you can only use the pencil and what you have to write here inside 15 20 lack of fusion a uh, lack of sidewall fusion you have to write by ink so i think you got this point now you can see here first is use a pencil for the arrow lines but make all written comments and measurement in ink only so this one you understand second is report everything that you can observe you can observe so what do you observe report you have to report in everything is there do not forget to compare and sentence your report so you have to compare which uh, is coming it is lack of sidewall fusion or lack of fusion you have to sentence you have to uh, uh, write there properly do not forget to data the data sorry date and sign of your report so you have to for uh, so many people maybe forget your date and sign so this is very important date you have to write and sign you have to sign the report make any observations such as a recommendation for further investigation for crack line imperfection so if you think any observation is there and if you need any future uh, investigation for that particular defect you have to write you can write there any recommendation so this is five inspection point very important point this five second what happened after finish all these things after you have observed an imperfection and determines its type you must be able to take measurement and complete the thumbprint report sketch so you observe all the imperfection and determine you understand the type what is the type of this uh, imperfection you have to check the measurement and complete the thumb print report or sketch you have to sketch the full as for arrow line you have to first arrow and what are the sizes there you have to mention there then you have to down, down of this arrow line you have to mention what is the actual imperfection i will explain in the next page what are the actual how it is how you have to write in the page thumb sketch thumbprint report sketch the first thumbprint report sketch should be in the form of repair map of the world all observation are identified size and located so first thumbprint report will be for print should be in the form of a repair map on the world and the thumbprint report sketch used in csu exam will look like the following example so now the second page and the uh, third page you can see here next page you can see here the uh, how we have to write in the report sketch print report sketch it's very important now you can see here the five final inspection report so how this is also important the five final inspection report for what to do after you have completed your thumbprint report sketch you have finished everything of your test five the next step is to what is the next step you finish everything your thumbprint report sketch arrow line what is the defect size and defect uh, what is the imperfection all these things you have completed the next step is to complete your final report again the report must be completed in ink no pencil so first you have to finish your this one first you have to finish your report by pencil then after that if you think that imperfection is correct and there is no problem so then that time you have to write in the same area ink ink colored you have to use in ink that is the defect what is the defect because you are already confirmed that this type of imperfection this is the imperfection which type of imperfection the report must be completed to your thumbprint sketch do not leave any boxes empty you cannot leave any boxes empty you have to find out the defect and you have to write there empty box must be completed or dashed out you must also make any comments you feel are necessary regarding any defects observed if you think any defects are there you have to write there the default form used in c-sweep will look like the following example so now this is the give the i will give the example how it looks like the report sketch you see here 
example pipe report they will give the same report same type of sketch in your exam you see name you have to write here name this is signature this is test piece indent 001 code is api 1104 welding process is mma smaw joint type is single v part welding position is flat pa and outside dia is 300 mm and 10 mm is the thickness so you have to write there also you have to mention there also date now you can see there is two types of one is the weld face another is the root face so weld face you have to you see here weld face so you have to do what is there this is your datum line this is your datum line and this is your datum line so you have to do measurement from here to here you can see here measurement from here 20 mm distance there is a 15 mm length lack of sidewall fusion same here 90 means from here to here it is 90 mm length far from 90 mm far there is the undercut is less the undercut is 10 mm length is undercut is there so you understand what is this from datum line always you have to measurement 140 you can see here 140 means from here to here 140 mm and there is a lack of fusion 8 mm lack of fusion from this 140 mm from the datum line so this is you clearly understand so this is the oiled face this is the oiled face and it is mentioned here you see cap height 4 mm you have to mention also this one cap height 4 mm oiled with 12 to 14 mm toe blend is poor misalignment high low 1 mm pattern and scale on the surface so you have to mention also this one the same type of plate they will give to you now the pipe weld face it is like that and pipe root face you see root face and the root is the same measurement are there may same measurement types are there but you have to find defects from there you can see here datum line from here to 20 mm same here 15 mm lack of root penetration is there you see here from datum line from here the left hand is the at the this from here to here is the 90 mm and there is the undercut length is 10 mm so this from here from you have to fill up all this complete segment old segment segment the root area you have to finish it and you have to understand uh, the full sketch of this pipe root face and pipe world face i think this sketch is clear now now they will give to you one of the specimen number this is you have your it, it is your acceptance criteria acceptance criteria is i think is you see here it is the acceptance criteria total is defect noted is accumulate total to and minimum alliance is how much and where is mentioned it is 7.8.2 and 7.8.2 from where 7.8.2 from api 1104 so if it is you you can find you can find uh, you you can find this 4 mm in the pipe and it is allowable allowance is maximum is 1.6 mm so it is reject so this page will be this this page you can see here this page will be give to you as per api 1104 and you can easily understand what is the maximum minimum allowance length allowance and what is coming in your plate on your pipe so if it is more than this maximum allowance definitely it is coming to reject so you understand this 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 all this mention here the defect excess old metal height excess old metal appearance incomplete filling so everything is mentioned clearly so what are the defect you understand you observe you then you have to write all these things here and you have to compare uh, as per the maximum allowance limit then you can confirm this is accept or rejected so you can write here the uh, the pipe has been examined of the requirement code specification api 1104 and is rejected accordingly so it is rejected request empire testing recommended arc strike or ground place record radiography required so this is the plate they will give to you so i think you should observe the each you understand the each page from this uh, for this video so you can easily understand so this is very important pipe code api 1104 in which 
which uh, clause it is coming if you go the reinforcement height that is 7.8.2 reinforcement appear 7.8.2 so all this clause you can coming from you can see in uh, api 1104 so i think uh, if people like this video and thanks a lot for this uh, watching the video don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel if you need anything about this uh, cc 3.1 api 510 and uh, and how this video is uh, you uh, elaborated please let me know i can uh, uh, so i can uh, get your point and anything you have any comment for this one so you can get in you can uh, uh, comment it in my comment box on youtube thanks a lot uh, thanks a watch thanks a lot again to watching my video thank you